Yo, hey everyone, hope you guys are having a good Monday afternoon. We are back here with some transfer news on Enzo Fernandez and how close if he's coming to Chelsea. We have to read you guys some reports. And this is what something that the Benfica president had to say. Um, he was basically saying, I quote, We all know that we have a situation with Enzo. That he has a clause in his contract so that so that means if the player wants and there is a club who pays the amount of money, you cannot stop that. That is what the Benfica president has said. Yet, they're still not trying to let him leave. They're trying to say that the way we've come about it, we're being disrespectful, blah, 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 all of these kind of things. Enzo has already said that he wants to leave the club. He wants to come to Chelsea. We are going to give you guys 120 million. David Ornstein has reported that we have submitted a 120 million euro bid for Enzo Fernandez. These are coming with different installments. My opinion, for whether or not Benfica want the money right now, but if you're going to be honest, you're getting 8 million up top, up front. No club is going to be giving you this kind of money plus 40 million add ons. No club is going to give you this amount of money. You are rejecting something that is going to be the world record fee for a midfielder. You guys are trying to deny yourself that just so you can hold him on for six months more. Just to leave, just to sell them for even half than what we were going to bid for. For me, that doesn't make any sense. And these guys are really just trying to hold Enzo for ransom. Man, free Enzo. Free Enzo. Put a free Enzo in the comment section if you want him to be free and come to Chelsea because he wants to come here. He, has, he hasn't He has said, no, I don't want to come to Chelsea. He's said it numerous amount of times. I want to come to Chelsea. Reports are now saying from Duncan Castle that saying, yep, Enzo, he's prepared to make a move to Chelsea this week. He wants to come. He wants Enzo. Enzo wants the board from Benfica to accept the bid. And that is what all Chelsea fans want. We want him to come to the club. This team that he's building, the team that we're building right now, Todd Bowley, Baghdad Bali, and um, Paul Winston Lee. Um, Paul Winston Lee. Um, you know, there's other co you know, the other directors and that Paul Winston Lee and stuff and so on and so on. These guys are building the team. We've got Enzo Fernandez, who he wants to come to be in the midfield with Andre Santos, Ruben Loftus Cheek, Mason Mount, Ngolo Kante, Mateo Kovacic, Carney Chiqui, Mecca. We have so many different options in the midfield. Lewis Hu as well. Why wouldn't Enzo want to come here? You guys are stopping him from coming to a team where we're going to literally gonna dominate the world. You guys are not going to win the Champions League. Let's be real, you're in the Champions League, got to the knockout rounds, fair enough. You are not going to win the Champions League. If you sell him now, you have two days after the expiry day of tomorrow where the well, England's transfer window ends. You guys still have two days where you can get a replacement. You don't need to sign someone that's, well, I'm not, I don't necessarily watch the Portuguese League, but I don't necessarily feel that you need someone, that you're not going to sign someone that's much lesser than Enzo with the amount of money that you have at your disposal. You'll find an adequate replacement to challenge for the league. To try and win the league, you have Enzo Fernandez. You guys are still not going to win the Champions League. Let's be real. You guys need to hurry up and let Enzo leave because Chelsea is where he wants to be. You guys are trying to stop him from achieving what he wants to be. And he's going to be the most expensive midfielder ever with this bid. If you guys accept the deal, 120 million euros, there's going to be no other person from a midfielder that's been this expensive. I can't even tell you the what Paul Pogba is probably the last most expensive midfielder, about 90 million. We are going to shatter that record. Let us complete that deal. Ben Fico, if you hear me, let Enzo leave. Free Enzo Fernandez. Free Enzo Fernandez. But you guys who's watching this video, let me know in the comment section below what you guys think. Should we sign Enzo? Should we not? Let me know your thoughts and opinions and comment free Enzo if you want him to come to Chelsea. Free Enzo. Hashtag free Enzo. But that's going to be it from me regarding this Chelsea transfer target update on Enzo Fernandez. Please like, share and subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, Snapchat and Facebook for more Chelsea content. I'm CFC Realist Blue and I'm out. Peace. Come on Chelsea. Come on Chelsea. Free Enzo. Free and zoom.